Hi friends good to see you again all I hope you all will be fine. And for all of you I pray that God fulfill all your dreams and give you lots of happiness. And my dear friends every time I try my best to give you all latest news. Therefore, you are requested to sit tight on your seats and enjoy the latest news. And the Iraqi Minister of Trade, Athir al Ghorari, declared on Monday that discussions to join the World Trade Organization, WTO, had resumed after more than a 16-year break. A statement issued by the Trade Ministry revealed that Iraqi negotiating teams began their preparatory meetings at the WTO's headquarters in Geneva, Switzerland, in preparation for the third meeting that will discuss Iraq's accession, the Iraqi news agency, INA, reported. During his participation in the 13th Ministerial Conference of the WTO held last February in the UAE capital, Abu Dhabi, Al Ghorari affirmed that Iraq fulfilled the conditions necessary to become a member of the WTO following the completion of economic reforms and the enhancement of the investment climate. The Iraqi trade minister indicated that Baghdad finalized issues related to goods and services in accordance with the deadlines set for integration into the international trade system. The Iraqi government expressed interest in joining the WTO after submitting a request to do so in 2004. Iraq needed to be a member of the multilateral international trade system in order to regain its place as a major player in the global economy. In addition to debating the future of the global trade movement in light of current challenges, Al Ghorari said that the conference sends a strong message to the countries of the world about the value of joining this organization. The Iraqi official added that Iraq is attempting to expand its commercial and economic connections around the world in order to create new opportunities for collaboration. And the Iraqi central bank's, CBI, sales of the US dollar surpassed $268 million in the currency auction on Tuesday. According to Shafak News correspondent, the bank sold today $268,096,834 in its auction. These sales were covered at a basic exchange rate of 1,310 Iraqi dinars per dollar for documentary credits and international settlements for electronic cards and external transfers and at a rate of 1,305 Iraqi dinars per dollar for cash transactions. The majority of dollar sales were directed towards bolstering balances abroad in the form of transfers and credits, amounting to $255,546,834, representing a 95% increase compared to cash sales, which amounted to $12,550,000. Two banks purchased cash dollars, while 13 fulfilled requests to bolster balances abroad. The total number of exchange and brokerage companies participating in the auction was 10 companies. Thanks take care.